It is Help Wanted Wednesday, and our promise is helping you find a job or helping your business find qualified workers. This morning, Gulf Coast Humane Society is trying to fill multiple positions, so if you love working with people and animals, think you might be a good matchmaker, and you love a happy ending, one of these jobs could be the perfect one for you. Say hi. Good girl. We're a big family here at the Gulf Coast Humane Society. What are you doing? What are you doing? And its executive director, Jennifer Galloway, says they are looking to grow that family. We're looking for kennel technicians and adoption counselors that would be working um, directly with the public and with the animals, helping them find great homes and taking care of them while they're here with us. Good girl, Izzy. Good girl. Both jobs crucial to keeping things running smoothly at Gulf Coast Humane Society. First job, kennel technician. Kennel technicians, I say, are some of the hardest working folks out there. They're cleaning the kennels in the morning because we want always our dogs and cats to be in the cleanest um, spaces allowable. And then in the afternoon, they're working with uh, you know customers trying to really match them with the right families to the right homes. Let's go. That kennel technician position, you're kind of like a matchmaker. You are like a matchmaker. You really get to know the animals, and you'll really get to know Corey is a really athletic dog, and she would be great with a really high energy family that wants to maybe take her out and run her in the park, things like that. So when you meet that family, you can make that connection. Congratulations on adopting Corey. Once that connection is made, the pair then goes to an adoption counselor in the lobby to finalize the adoption. The adoption counselor is the last person that the adoption doctor then deals with before they walk out the door. Here is your adoptions paperwork. Yeah. There's a little kit to get you started. And here's some food. They're going to sign a contract. They're going to go over all the different medical and vaccines that the animal has received in our care. You guys are so lucky. She's an amazing girl. I'm so excited. Galloway says the best part is knowing you are making a difference. Working for a nonprofit that takes in animals from the worst of situations and giving them a second chance. Yes, maybe sad as they're coming in the door, but we get to see the joy as they go out the door to their forever homes. That's my good girl. Bye, Corey. Gotta love a happy ending. Now, both positions can be full or part-time. Both do require, of course, good customer service skills. So Gulf Coast Humane Society is hoping that you have some experience in that area or at least some experience with animals. But again, they will train you. Galloway says full-time employees do get benefits. We have more information on these job openings and more information on how to apply when you go to fox4now.com slash rebound. And if you have a job opening you want featured in our Help Wanted Wednesday segment, just send me an email. Lisa.Greenberg at fox4now.com. You can also send me a message on Facebook.